Okay, and welcome back to a new video. Now in today's video, we're going to be continuing with this egg system. This is part 6 of the series, and today we're going to be doing the interactions. So what we're going to be doing is making a pop-up open that says E to open. Then when we press E, it's going to come up with a menu that says, would you like to open this egg for however much it costs? And we might also be doing some modeling for eggs we haven't unlocked at the end of the video. Now with all that being said, please leave a like, subscribe, and let's get on with it. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go into start player, start player scripts, game, and then egg display, okay? Open up this, and this is where we're going to script the interaction opening and closing. Now I'll skip part of this video up, but make sure you follow along, and with that being said, let's get into it. Okay, so let's just go ahead and give this a quick test. As you can see, this function opens it, this function closes it. Let's go ahead and click play. And when we click it, it should print the name of the egg. Awesome, that works. Let's give it a click. There you go, open basic egg. Okay, awesome. Now let's just stop this for a second. Go back into here and we need to add a wait time. So wait 0 0.2. Let's just do that here. Let's give it one more test real quick. Awesome. That seems to work perfectly. So exit out of your egg display script and now go into start a GUI. What we're going to do is we're going to create the menu that says, would you like to open this egg for however much it cost? Once again, I'll leave the UI down in the description below. And with all that being said, Let's get on with it. Okay, so I just went ahead and created this UI. Now, once again, it is in the description below if you want to go get it. Okay, so now what we're going to do is go into Start Player, Start Player Scripts, GUI, and then Buttons, okay? We're gonna do local. I won't skip this part up because it's pretty simple, but we're gonna do local pop-up. Pop-up equals uh, player GUI, wait for child pop-up. And all we're gonna do here is if pop-up dot enable, then return end. Now what this does, okay, if this is enabled, it can't open any other GUIs like the inventory. So that's what we're going to do for this. We're also going to do down here pop up dot uh, frame dot close dot mouse or dot activated connect function. Then pop up dot enabled equals false okay so now that's done we're going to x out of this script and what we're going to do is we're just going to go back into our egg display script and start player game then egg display now where it says open egg what we're going to do is we're going to get the egg cost and the egg name and display it on that pop-up now once again i will skip the video up make sure you follow along and with that being said let's get into it Let's give this one more test. There you go, would you like to buy the basic egg for free? Okay, so now what we're gonna do is just start on the egg model. So the first thing we're gonna do is change this text label to display the amount it cost. And we're also gonna add a float animation on the egg. 
So go ahead into egg display. Now let's add a new function called function egg display. Now the first thing we're gonna do is change the setup egg function to egg display, okay? So egg display. Now we're gonna do if not, let's add an egg in here. If not egg get attributes. If not egg get attribute set up then egg set attribute make that true. Now this is where we're gonna run this function again. So just set up egg egg. Let's just go ahead and give this a quick test. Yeah, it still works. Okay, awesome. Now, let's go ahead and stop. Let's go back into the egg display script. And this is where we're gonna display the amount it costs. And we're also gonna add a nice animation to this. Now I'm gonna skip the rest of this part up. Make sure you follow along. And with that being said, let's get into it. Okay, there we go. As you can see, our egg now spins and it floats a little bit too. Okay, awesome. Now let's go ahead and make the egg display the cost. Okay, now let's give this a quick test. It should display as free because the egg doesn't cost anything. And there you go, as you can see, this egg is free. When we walk up to it, click E, it comes up with this. Okay, now let's just go ahead and make it cost, let's say a hundred cash, okay? Just to give it a test. So replicate storage, modules, egg stats, cost 100. Click play. There you go, it says 100. Okay, awesome, that worked. So that's gonna do for today's video. In the next video, we're gonna be working on the egg unlock system. So if the egg isn't unlocked, it will have a lock around it, and this will say locked, things like that. Now, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.